<laughs> Nowadays, I can't even think of a war leader that I truly admire. Except for one, that is, guys. The last time that I truly admired a world leader was when the 44th President of the United States, or Barack Obama, was getting elected. You know, I really admire his ability to inspire and also his ability to rise from nothing to be the most powerful person in the world at the time. And nowadays, I admire another leader, and this time is my, my very own, Abi which is a prime minister of Ethiopia. Now, the reason why I admire Abi guys is first of all, I admire his mind. And secondly, I admire his spirituality, guys. He told a story how his mom used to tell him that one day that he was going to be a king of Ethiopia. And also he went on to tell the story about how he grew up so poor but in his mind he was not poor even one day in his life guys in his imagination he was a president and in his imagination he was a king his circumstance did not define him guys his circumstance of what he was going through did not affect the young boy he told one of the stories that he told was, especially in the mornings when his mother used to send him to go out and buy sugar. You know what I mean? He would go to the side of his house and pretend like he's driving a car in his mind, in his imagination, and run as if he was driving a car. You know, in his mind, he said he never walked even one day in his life, guys. Another story that he told was about the sheets that he used to sleep with. His family was so poor, they only had one sheet or one blanket to sleep with. He said he used to put one of them at the bottom, you know, and then use the same one to make it as the second one and use the same one to make it as the third one. In his mind, in his imagination, guys. You know what I'm saying? That is a testimony that your circumstance is not bigger than you guys. You are bigger than your circumstance. Let me tell you something. You understand what I'm saying? Guys, today is Sunday, and this is your Sunday motivational video. Let's go. Huh. <laughs> Hello, beautiful people of the world. This is Alula, and welcome to Awaken the Ego with it. Like this video and subscribe for more videos like this, guys. Guys, welcome to a Sunday motivational video. I'm back with another video to motivate you, just to send you my energy wherever you are, guys. Can I send you my energy through this screen? Yeah. Hello, my chosen one. Sunday is the day that I feel so inspired, guys. Let me also wrap my energy onto you. Let me also inspire you to be all that you can be this morning, guys. Today, I want to talk about reasons or how your current circumstance doesn't define you, guys. Reasons why you're bigger than your circumstance. Let me tell you now. Now, one of the things about a serpent or a snake, guys, is like when you come near him, he makes himself as bigger than he is just to make his prey or to make his enemy be afraid of him, guys. And this is the same thing that your circumstance do to you. Your circumstance may appear... The you know, to be bigger than you. But don't let that fool you, guys. You are bigger than any situation, guys. And you are bigger than any of the circumstance that you are facing. And that's what I'm saying. You basically have to know that you are God to your situations, guys. And you have ability to really handle your problems and really 
keep pushing boundaries and reaching new heights. You know what I mean? Some reasons why you are bigger than your uh, circumstance, guys. First thing first is life has seasons. There is seasons in life that everybody has to go through, guys. But the thing about season is seasons end. And all that will remain from that season is the lesson and the things that you learn and the memories that you've acquired from that time, guys. Just because you're facing hardship, it does not mean that this is your permanent circumstance, guys. Problems is seasonal. Everything is seasonal. You yourself, you season, guys. Just in case you're going through a season of hardship, this is me in my video telling you just to hold on guys this is me in this video encouraging you and telling you that this season shall end and that's what i'm saying guys when it rains it never looks like it's gonna be sunny but you know it will and when it's sunny it doesn't look like it will rain but you know it will guys it's just a matter of time so what season are you in, my chosen one? Whatever season that you're in, understand that it's not permanent. Understand that life is a journey. It has different, different seasons. And all the season is, every season is here to make you the person that you're meant to be, guys. Just because you're going through a hardship, it doesn't mean this is your permanent circumstance guys my chosen one life is a journey look at life as if you're cruising down the street and you're going to another city now when you go into another city you pass through projects you pass through nice areas you pass through different different things in order for, for you to get to your destination guys just like that journey in life guys you're gonna be met with a lot of different different situations and that's what i'm saying there's gonna be bumps on the road while you're traveling while you're traveling to get to the next city guys there's no doubt about it now the most important thing that you can do is hold on and keep this car on the road guys just keep on driving straight regardless of the bumps and regardless of what's going on on the road you understand what i'm saying some of you will need to make a stop and have you know rest for the day eat you know what i mean it doesn't mean that you're gonna be living there guys it just means that you're passing through this place or this circumstance at this time but you know your destination you know where you're going my chosen one because you've already seen it in your mind because you've already seen it in your mind guys in your imagination you know what i'm saying Life is a journey and you will pass through many, 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 many different, different situations, different circumstances and different people that you come across. You know what I mean? But the main thing, my chosen one, is that you keep focused and you keep on going regardless of the situation or the things that you meet along the way, guys. Just because you have stopped your car and have a rest in like a, some little town don't think that's your destination you're just there now to, for you to rest to regroup and carry on with the journey guys the journey of life i don't know who i'm talking to this morning but if you are faced with the mountain this morning let me tell you my chosen one it's just some amount of time until you get past this mountain you know what i'm saying it's just a matter of time until you pass through this hardship guys and once you pass this hardship you gonna understand that that's part of the journey you understand that's part of the trip guys it all comes with it the thing about life guys is that you have to experience life fully not only the good parts not only the parts when you uh, when you are really at your best guys 
in life, there are times where you're not feeling your best. There are times when you are down. There are times where you don't. You know, not on your purpose, not on. There are times where you're not yourself, guys, regardless of the situation. It doesn't matter what's going on outside, guys. You have to keep on believing. You have to know that whatever you imagined will come to life, guys. You know what I'm saying? Truly, you are bigger than your situation, my chosen one. Tough times, guys. Build strong characters, really. Guys, we only grow through trauma. Don't forget that. So if you're faced with the mountain, if, you were, if you're faced with a circumstance that seems to be do, too big for you, understand that this is happening for you guys. Understand it's all for you, my chosen one. You understand what I'm saying? Don't say, why me? Say, try me, guys. You know what I'm saying? Guys, we never grow in comfort. We never grow when things are good. We only grow when we are faced with the mountain, guys. We only grow when we are faced with drama. Let me tell you something. Oh, uh, look at this bird. Hello, bird. <laughs> Man, I'm going to see this bird here like often. I think this one likes my energy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, guys? Truly, truly, tough characters build tough people. You understand what I'm saying? Just wish that you have enough strength for you to pass this time because the lesson that you're going to get out of this, guys, will be a lesson for life. Let me tell you something. Two of the most important times in my life that I remember was when I was living in two of the dark night of the souls, guys. This time was the most hardest time for me and also the was the best time for me now looking back at it guys it was the time that i built a character that i'm really proud of guys because of the hardship it was a time where i really was fighting with the devil that was inside of me guys it was the time that i was proving to myself who i'm really made of am i really the son of a a, a, a living father or not and let me tell you something eh? something else guys that confidence comes from overcoming really tough situations you understand what I'm saying? confidence comes from dealing with situations and really really winning everything life has thrown at you maybe I shouldn't say everything I say most things guys really really if you're facing with trauma if you're facing with hardship whatever it may be guys understand that is all happening for you you know what i'm saying man i heard this billionaire talk about how he made his fortune once he said that he he was homeless you know and to be a billionaire first he had to be homeless man that's powerful right there because it's only when you're down, it's only when you're facing with your mountain that you, you get to understand what's really important uh, in your life, guys. It's only when you're uncomfortable that you expand. You know what I mean? One of the quotes that I really like was, is like, the more you face, uh, how did it say? The more you like being uncomfortable, the more your comfort zone expands i think something like that the more you place yourself in difficult situation guys the more you can handle difficulties the more you're a leader guys the more people will admire you for what you did guys my chosen one what is your circumstance this morning what are you faced with you know what i'm saying if you're faced with the circumstance that seems to be too big for you, understand that it ain't. You are truly the son of a living father. You are God in the flesh, guys. You are a vessel which God uses to express himself. So it's just a matter of time until you overcome this problem, guys. You understand what I'm saying? 
keep upgrading yourself keep loving yourself keep imagining the life you want for yourself my chosen one if you just keep staying in that state it's just a matter of time until whatever you wish will come to life just like prime minister abi he said that he used to tell his friends that one day they're gonna work for him while he'll be a president and now he's a president and his friends are working for him that is incredible guys the man literally spoke his life into existence and you too my chosen one you have the power to really speak your life into existence guys this is your power you're creating god's image you understand what i'm saying once a man decides he wants to be something and let me tell you now he can be it he just have to stay in that imagination stay in imagination until whatever he wishes comes true guys okay guys thank you so much for watching this is your sunday motivational video like this video subscribe to this channel for more videos like this until the next video god bless you and take care guys there we go man today is a beautiful day really really you know today the 22nd of august we have passed through the winter now we're going into the spring you see it's just like that first point i was talking about the season the winter has ended now we're going to the spring from now on i can tell it's gonna be nice nice weather moving forward guys okay my eagles take care bye bye